Hello everybody, welcome to Super Ninja 20,000 Reactions, I'm your host Super Ninja 20,000, and today we're going to be watching Ruby, Volume 7, Episode 11, Gravity. So, yeah, so they, they, they were able to lure out Watts um, using the unfinished Amity Arena, and they're about to, um, and Ironwood and Watts are about to have a really fun fight, as well as um, Crow, Clover, and... Robin versus Tyrion. So we're going to see how that goes, as well as um, Ru um, no, um, Cinder and Neo are up to shenanigans as well. So let us just hop right in there and see. Let's begin in three, two, one, and start. I'm excited for this. Wait, hold up. Did I. I did not. There we go. That's not the way I was trying to do that, and that's the way I wanted to do it. There we go. That works. Keep dreaming about it. I know I forgot something. You keep wishing for some clarity. Always hoping that a lightning bolt is going to save you from this gravity. You're holding up for so many lives. Maybe you'll wake up in a world of shock. Oh, but what's in your sight? You don't have to dream. You're going to be good. I'm excited. Just, I'm excited to kind of wait because you never know with these finales whether they're gonna kill everybody or if they're you're gonna have um, stuff go have to go look at like sometimes. We shall see. I am intrigued to see how it goes. Yeah, it's gonna be I'm fucked. If you're like three episodes away, no, two episodes away from the finale, and it's gonna be good. Like a Tetris style thing kind of here. Let's see how this thing goes. Boys. I like the lace Oh, yeah, gravity. Okay. This is a fun battle. It's really fun. I remember it's good at like keeping yourself going. It's like a fucking platformer. <laughs> I would die. I like this verse music, but just what I would do to do is just too often. He was expecting it. Just pulls it up. Just pull it. Crack it. Casually chokes the life out of him. I'm getting back to Ruby at. Oh, like. Oh, no. I'm getting a little bit of OG Ruby vibes in this a little bit. But the way this fight's going is just great. Oh, there goes the pistol. Seven. Good job. I'm smart as a boy. Ooh. <laughs> oh, he's been counting Ironwood shots. Not his own. Nope. I don't think he's get back here. There goes his aura. Oh, 
but she's just so fun. You never appreciated my genius, James. He's out of You bullet. just stood the top and called yourself a giant. <laughs> They're both out of bullets now? Okay. I gave you everything you could have wanted. You chose that fat imbecile over me. Don't mess with Paula, Dana. I suppose in this instance, my brains and your brawn are evenly matched. You're smart, but you're not the only one who can count. Everyone's out of bullets. Oh, I know. Oh, I glided into the thing. Cool. He's gonna sit with a hand. Oh! That was a little too close for my liking, James. Rebuilding those rings is going to be such a pain. Now, if you'll excuse me. Casually yoinks his arm out. I, I wouldn't do that if I were you. I mean, unless you're hoping to add more metal to that body of yours. He doesn't go. Where did they put the Alright, we're gonna do that. He yoinked his arm out. <sighs> now he's gonna beat the crap out of him. What? Get him! Kill him. Toss him to the wall. Actually, that won't work because he can still control him for sure. I will sacrifice whatever it takes to stop her. <laughs> oh, I hope you do, James. I hope you do. Come on, toss him! Tyrion Kalos, you're under arrest. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Let's get into this fight. He doesn't, look, he's not even serious he doesn't have a set, he doesn't even have this freaking side yet. I, I like the casual, casual punches from, from pros. But now this feels like a ruby fight. Or quarter of fight, just slightly, slightly slower than normal. Oh, yes. Yes. Get him. Right in. Oh, it's explosive. Here goes that aura. <laughs> Where's that smile now? Stabbing her. This is Clover, requesting prisoner transport. Guess he tossed him. We have Tyrion Kalos in custody. What happened? What's wrong? All students are to remain indoors until further notice. Faculty What's and upperclassmen can provide gut. Schnee. Yes, sir. Was anyone caught trying to enter the school grounds while I was away? N no. Are you sure? Still afraid, I see. Now show me where you've been hiding her. I don't like when they tell anything. I don't understand. Us. Why would the general call us back without giving a reason? 
especially with evacuation still going on in Mantle. You don't have to understand orders, kids. You just have to follow them. Civi transports won't be stopping anytime soon. The General says he needs us now, he needs us now. You all get to the General and find out what's happening. We'll bring Oscar and see you soon. What's going on? General Ironwood? We have made a critical error. The Black Queen was the symbol Salem showed us before we lost everything. Her way of telling us she was inside. That it was too late. We stopped Watts. We stopped Kalos, but someone was here. They put this in my office to tell me that it... What if Mantle was just a distraction? What if it was just to draw us away from the Academy to... to... Sir, it's going to be okay. We've got Mantle on our side now, and... How do we know that wasn't part of their plan? How do we know they didn't want us to bring people into Atlas by the thousands? In trying to save everyone, we left ourselves most vulnerable. Salem has been one step ahead of us this entire time! I'm not sure about that. It's... glass. Cinder. Black glass. This was Cinder. She's alive? And she's here? If Cinder's here, then for all we know, Hazel's here too. Sir, this isn't over yet. We're with you. Are you with me? What? Sir? Come on now, Ironwood. How did Robin know about the Global Communications Project? Good, good job, you two. We told her. The night of the ambush. You did what? We were trying to help. Something you that behind her backs? Wait. Does that mean you let her escape? Robin is on our side. She always has been. We didn't know that for sure. Something's in that bag. None of this matters right now. Loyalty always matters. That's <gasps> it. There's something in that bag. General Ironwood. It explode. The brave huntsman and huntress okay, that was good. Arthur Watts. Congratulations. We stopped Tyrion too. And we'll stop Cinder and anyone else you try to send here. Dear girl, their goal was never victory. It was merely to set the stage. For what? For me. That's what she always thinks. Time isn't on your side, James. It's always been on mine. The people of Atlas have suffered enough. Surrender the staff and the lamp to me, and they needn't suffer any further. Just come along. That's... not going to happen. Simply accept the futility of your situation. And this can all be over. We've seen what you're capable of. The lamp showed us. It showed us everything. We've seen that you can't be killed. But we've also seen you fail. We don't have to kill you to stop you. And we will stop you. Good girl. Your mother said those words to me. Oh no! This ain't good! My no. mother? Oh no. She was wrong too. Oh 
This ain't good. Just freaked her out immediately. That's Salem? That's who we're up against? And she's apparently on her way. But we'd be alerted if any forces had approached the kingdom. We have long-range proximity alarms all along the coast and- They're offline. With all of the chaos we didn't notice. Watts must have shut them down! Or they've already been destroyed. I knew it wasn't going to last. All of them? You said in your speech that Amity Tower was ready to launch. Was that true? No. You just said that. To lure out Watts. General Ironwood? I've sent your sister to claim the power of the Winter Maiden. What? When I realized we'd been compromised, I knew we couldn't wait any longer. The staff and the lamp have to be locked away. I thought... You said we could keep it. Well, that was before you lied to me about the lamp. Before you lied to us about Robin. Before Salem was right on our doorstep. Before Mantle was nearly destroyed. And myself and my army were left exhausted. The timeline has changed. And so we must change accordingly. What are our orders, sir? We are going to take our plan for Amity Tower and apply it to the city of Atlas. What? It was Oz's plan in a former life, but he didn't take it far enough. If we harness the power of the staff and raise ourselves high into the atmosphere, the city's artificial climate will keep citizens and food supplies unharmed, always out of reach of whatever Salem may try to send our way. But we're nowhere near finished evacuating everyone. You'd be leaving Mantle to die. Yes, I would. Take it, Ironwood. We can't allow Salem to capture the relics. This is our best chance at getting the staff, the lamp, and the maiden as far away from her as possible. But we have an opportunity to reunite the world. If we launch the tower, we can all work together again. We could even call for help. If we can hold out long enough... Sometimes, doing the right thing means making tough decisions. You're right. And I think the right thing to do would be to stand our ground. Me too. Me too. Me too. He's gonna ignore him this time. We ran ourselves ragged trying to save Mantle tonight. We try that again against an even larger force? But your huntsmen and huntresses! You can't just back down from a fight! You can't focus on one single fight while trying to win a war. What's the council going to say? Nothing. Once I declare martial law. No. Oh, what about Robin? Who exactly are you loyal to? We're loyal to the people counting on us to save them! We are saving who we can. And you're standing in our way. Oh boy, that didn't go like I thought. Good? It's John. We've got a serious problem. Uh oh, we got issues. I was declaring martial law and abandoning Mantle. Salem is coming, and he's going to use the staff to move Atlas. If we don't stop him, Mantle's going to be just. I'm sorry it's come to this, but until Atlas and the relics are safe, you are all under arrest. We won't just let you take us. Aww. I know. Well, this didn't end well at all. That just got me. Ruby, are you oh, there? I can feel the gravity of this situation. Did you tell them? Oscar, 
Where are you? <gasps> oh boy. This, this ain't good. This ain't good at all. Um, oh yeah, yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Woo so, she, um, who is it? Um, what's her face? Um, Winter's going to take the ring mate in power. Um, Neo has taken Oscar. And I would declare martial law and has gone a little bit crazy. See what he's doing, but he's about to, like, kill a whole bunch of innocent people, and everyone's fighting, so Reaper's an ace office, ace office at least. Here's to hoping Clover doesn't do, doesn't fight Crow and Robin on this. We shall see how it goes. And Chit gets away again! So, as always, please like, subscribe, comment down below what you like to chat to next. And as always, this is Super Ninja 1000, seven up.